Welcome back guys and your boy B Blaster has finally decided to try out Strike of Kings which for some reason is called Arena of Valor on the Play Store but in the actual game they're still calling it Strike of Kings but hey let's just go with it so I'm just going to be doing a quick casual match nothing um, too serious I just want to do something quick So this is the game that basically Tencent developed for the West and it's supposed to kind of be an English version of King of Glory. But after playing a few matches, seriously, it just it just lacks that polish, that finish touch. Anyway, where's this guy? The shifting sands are at As in car. I like to call him Sandman because it's basically what he does, he controls sand. But as I was saying, yeah, it just, it lacks that finished touch. I don't know, the, the character models look a bit uh, sloppy compared to, not sloppy, maybe that's the wrong word to use, but less refined than King of Glory. And the only reason I'm even comparing these two MOBAs, I just want to make this clear, is because this is supposed to basically be the English version of King of Glory. Tencent designed this game for the West instead of making an actual English version of King of Glory. So I think it's only logical that you compare the two games since we've seen the quality that Tencent can deliver with King of Glory. So I'm just putting it out there. Okay, let the match begin. Okay, so by the way I haven't even played ranked yet so I'm going to be versing some noobs let me get the buff don't overextend get back to farming who comes up with these phrases man <laughs> anyway this guy is like Zenji did you see that second skill that's Zenji. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that since they basically own both games, but it's kind of funny. Yep, that guy's dead. And there's also another hero, um, like um, what's what's her name? Zaljun. The chick who controls ice and does that whole ult with the ice move which freezes people etc. There's another character like her in this game. They kind of just... <laughs> it's the same moveset but they just made it sand instead of water literally. I mean it's really cool though. Um, see look at this ult it's different I like the hand I really like that hand okay so yeah this match is going to end super quick but I don't know guys what do you think do you want me continue playing this game or do you think I should continue playing this game because I like King of Glory a lot but the problem with King of Glory is the connection like I've been speaking to some Chinese friends and they all really say the same thing that the reason you know most foreigners and me for example lose is mainly because of the connection like playing with Red Ping consistently and having random lag spikes it's, it's annoying I'm not gonna lie it's really annoying and sometimes your character just randomly starts running forward when you didn't even tell him to do that so that's the only downside as well as the matchmaking system which can sometimes be good but generally not that good for me I don't know why he jumped right into the middle of two enemies, but... 
and I control sand. Right into it. Oh yeah, sorry guys, I kind of got engrossed into the game. But there isn't really that much for me to say, so... If I can kind of kill this guy when he's in base, that would be kind of cool. The thing I don't like is that you can play as Batman. Like, what's that about? I know I'm going to get a lot of hate for that, but why would you want to play as Batman? Actually, I take that back. I take that back right now. I wouldn't mind playing as Batman, but his moveset is so simplistic. Like, I watched, because, well, when Batman first got released, there was game trailers about him, like, all over the place. And I watched one of them because I was curious. Okay, if Batman's in the game, I hope they could do some, you know, do him some justice. But his moveset is appalling, in my opinion. Like, there's no real special effects apart from him flapping his cape. And this isn't even, like, a grill or, you know, me trying to, like bring the game down it's a full-on fact if you've seen batman's gameplay there isn't that much you know special effects and i love seeing cool effects when you use a skill it, you know it makes you more engrossed in the game anyway guys i probably will be playing more of this since i have green ping <laughs> green connection so it's all smooth it's all crispy and you know me i like things when they're crispy so with that said, thanks for watching guys, feel free to like, comment, share and subscribe and let me know what you think. So what do you guys think of Strike of Kings? Is it a game that you want to play a lot? How do you think it compares to King of Glory? Um, yeah, just let me know your thoughts about this game. With that said, I'm out.